happy Friday. We're doing a little New York City weekend in my life. This is gonna be a really fun weekend. We're starting the weekend off by getting our nails done. I have these awesome nails right now. I go to Nails by Mickey in the Lower East Side. She's incredible. We are now best friends. She does my nails, Brooke's nails, Margo's nails. We're like her little trio. Um, so I did these nails for our Gals on the Go podcast shoot because we did a branding shoot and these are some of our Gals on the Go colors. But it is officially fall as of September 22nd. So I'm doing fall nails. I want to do like different shades of brown on each nail. I don't even think tips. I want to do like the full color on the full nail if that makes sense. Gonna head over now. Here's my little fit. Um, the sweatshirt I got at the Rails event I went to yesterday. It's so comfortable. And then I just figured out that these sweatshorts are actually from Rails too. The more you know. And then of course the good old... Nike Air Force. Just wash my hair and use my Dyson Airwrap to kind of brush it out, but I'll probably need to style it more when I get back. Today is a really exciting day because I'm getting the iPhone 13. I'm so excited. Um, I've had this phone for about two years and in the you know social media space, you take all your photos pretty much on your camera for the most part. And, um, or on your phone, should I say, on your phone camera. And this camera looks out of this world. Um, I'm investing in it, I'm really excited. And even more so, Brooke and I <laughs> coordinated picking up our phones at the Apple store in Soho together at the same time today. <laughs> we both pre-ordered it the day it came out and we're both picking it up together. We just thought it'd be fun, you know? Gals up and go, okay? And then tonight we're celebrating my boyfriend's birthday because he turned 23 a couple nights ago and it was like a work night and he was just tired, we just went to dinner. So me and his roommates kind of planned a little something. So we're going to a brewery in Brooklyn. I'm so pumped. It looks like a really cool spot, great reviews. So it's gonna be a great day. Let's go get our nails done. This is the ideal situation. Cool. Hi, babies. I am obsessed you guys. I'm trying to find the best lighting. So I went with the fall inspired nails of different shades of brown on each color. Last fall I did different shades of brown as a tip and it just didn't do it for me. So I'm really excited. It was, oh, it looks so good. I have gel extensions if you guys are wondering. And then next time I go, we'll take them off and then it'll be my natural nails. We were just growing out my natural nails. They look so great. Mickey Nail Co. She's incredible. We literally talked the whole time. She makes me laugh so hard. Stopped by Paws Cafe and got a coffee after and it literally, they're like coffee nails. I love it. Just got back, guys. I'm, I'm a little too obsessed with my nails. I think I was just getting so tired of the bright colors. This is so fun for fall. Um, so I got an iced oat milk latte because I was getting really sleepy during it. She's like, you're really sleepy, aren't you? I said, yes. And I've always wanted to try the bowls um, at Paws Cafe. Oh, this is dark. <laughs> oh, that's some dark green. So it's a green bowl. I got pineapple strawberry on top with the granola and I think there's agave. So this is gonna be my little, little lunch. So Brooke and I are going to Aspen, Colorado next week with a, a wellness company. I'm so excited. You guys will definitely already know by the time this vlogs up because we'll be posting. So I immediately went to Revolve and I was like, I have to get some fall things because it is a little bit colder there right now. That's like the high is 68. Been really wanting another like wide brimmed hat. So I got this one. I'll link all these things down below. This one's from Lack of Color off of Revolve. I love this color. Sometimes like you just wanna wear a hat, it completes the outfit and maybe your hair isn't amazing. Boom, done. I got a size small, hopefully it fits my head. Okay, it does. Whew. You know, like just to wear with a sweater and going apple picking. <laughs> Not that we'll be doing that in Colorado, but this is definitely coming with. I'm excited. Glad I got small. It's kind of so big on my head. This is definitely a pricier item. Um, but I'm so excited. It's gonna be a big jacket for me this fall. I'm so pumped about this jacket, you guys. It's this beautiful brown moto jacket. And it's a little cropped, but I on the model, it looks like it was super wide. It has like a little shoulder padding, it feels like. So it just creates this super dramatic look. This is coming to Colorado with me. I wanna wear like a little um, turtleneck bodysuit tucked into some jeans with this. I think it'll be so perfect. I I'm seriously so excited to wear this. I'm obsessed with jeans and Brooke reads about her Citizens of Humanity jeans, so I wanted to try them out for myself. Okay, I got a size 27, because normally I'm a size 28, but I was told these run a little big. Um, and these are the, these are the Anina trouser jeans. I just love baggy jeans. Um, so hopefully these fit, I'll update you guys, but they feel really soft, really nice. 
I got these biker shorts because I only have like one pair of black biker shorts that I wear every day. And these are, they were um, advertised as seamless and they definitely are. They don't have any logos or anything. So I thought they'd be good for more elevated outfits, you know? Because I don't really like wearing like athletic biker shorts and like a cool top with a like a blazer, you know? So these I feel like are gonna be perfect for more fashionable um, outfits with biker shorts, if that makes sense. So I'll link everything I showed down below. That's my little haul, my little fall haul. I'm getting in the fall mood. I've been summer, summer, summer. And this week I'm just like, let's go fall. All right, about to go head out to meet Brooke. I just feel 10 times better now that I got ready. I had a lot of outfit issues, but I'm really happy with what I ended up with. Here is today's fit. I can't stop wearing these pants. They're so comfortable. The firm revolve, I'll link them below if they're not sold out yet. They're just these fun green cargo pants. And I actually haven't worn this t-shirt yet. And I had it hanging up. I was so excited. It's just a crop white tee. I'll also link it below. It's just got a pocket. It's like the perfect boxy fit. Air Force ones, because it's like a 30 minute walk to Soho, so. Let's go. Guys, I can't make this up. Brooke and I just literally I had know. the same idea. It's just, <laughs> I, had, I knew you had those pants, but I was just like. I actually had a completely different outfit on and then I switched last minute. So we are both um, white shirt, green cargo pants, white sneakers. <laughs> That's just how it goes, baby. <laughs> Rolling deep. Headed to the Apple store, I'm so excited. This is the place I saw Danny DeVito, I always say that. I'm very excited. But like, we're gonna get it and we can't like do anything with it, you know? We have to like go back and no, I can't set wait to it up sit in my bed and sit in like today. that's what I'm doing. We're worried about the phone cases, you guys. If they're gonna fit our current one, I bought one on Casefy like a week ago. Yeah. About a week ago. They're so worth it, but sometimes it do take a little bit longer in the shipping. But it, yes. they're custom and stuff. So did you get a copy? Yeah, I got like DC, DC, oh, DC, yeah. DC. <laughs> We're checking out the San Genovia Festival. It's our heritage. <laughs> Italian. Hello. I've been wanting to walk through this. I wonder how long it's here for. So cute. All right, baby, had to get a phone case because I don't want to drop it while I'm waiting for my new one. I got silver, Brooke got gold. We got iPhone 13 Pro Max, 500 gigs. We just really loaded it up. Terabytes extra, and we have iCloud storage, so excited. I did brown, she did a pink case. Headed into Aloe Yoga. I've never been into this one, or I guess it's just called Aloe. Oh, okay. <laughs> Headed into Aloe. Never been into this one. This one has a cafe in it, I think. Cool. This is why I love New York. Just got some watermelon on the side of the road. Walking down Broadway. It's a good day. Hey guys, so I'm back now. I rushed back because I had a meeting or a video call at 6.30. I haven't even set up my phone yet. I don't even think that's happening tonight because we're going to this brewery in Brooklyn at 8.45 and it's 6.45 and I, I want, I don't want to make myself edit on a Saturday night again and I want my video to go up on Sunday so I'm gonna finish editing now so that I can like go into the weekend and know that my video is up, you know? All right guys, I just got ready and I am just now realizing that I'm the only girl going out tonight. Um, my girlfriends bailed on me um, for a good reason. They were working late and Brooke just is too tired to go out tonight. My house is like freezing cold. So I'm headed into a room of five boys. <laughs> Ryan and a ton of his friends who I'm obviously really close with too. But I just, I haven't had fireballs since my birthday party, so I'm a little sensitive, but we're just gonna do this. Whew, okay. Also, this is my little fit. I'm wearing a leather jacket too. Oh my God, I'm like not ready for this. My friend gave me these for my birthday. Um, spiked kombucha, maybe I should try it first before I use it as a chaser. Oh wait, carrots. Duh. Oh wait, I don't have any carrots. Cheers, you guys. All right, pretty basic outfit, but we're going to a brewery in Brooklyn, so I just wanted to feel out the vibes. I didn't want to like, I don't know. I mean, it's New York. But I I feel like this is just an easy go-to outfit. White tank, leather jacket, jeans, and sneaks. Switching to some bigger hoops, got a little necklace on. Gonna grab just like my white shoulder bag, I think. And then we'll be good to go. I'm gonna head over to the boys' apartment. Hang out there for a little bit. Yeah, that's good. And then we'll go. All right, I'm gonna ask to transfer to my phone. I also still haven't updated my phone, so it's still the iPhone 11. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It's Saturday morning. We're doing a little bagel run because that's how it goes. 
The boys are all out waiting for me. They're all spring chickens this morning, so I'm glad because it's game day. Let's do it. Got some OJ, Ryan got some iced coffee, got the goods. And banana. Ooh, healthy. Watching Georgia game getting ready to go watch it somewhere else. I just showered um, We're having a little late start to the morning. We all went and got bagels ate them on my roof. It was really fun um, But we're not gonna go to the George bar today because it's a 12 o'clock game and I think we're gonna win Sorry Vanderbilt fans got this in the mail. I ordered this from Amazon. It's a door draft guard um, Because I think I was telling you guys my door makes like a noise every time someone on my hall opens the door so I got a gray one, hoping it'll blend in with the door. I really, really, really hope this works. In need of some coffee this fine morning. Sorry this is late, but I hope you love it and think of how much fun we have with our movie poster. <laughs> yeah, we never finished that. So freaking cute, 50 of the best cocktails. And it's like the movie poster we had in our apartment. You scratch it off if you've drink in it. So thoughtful, oh my God, Delaney. Please revive me. All right, so the dogs are already winning 35 to zero, um, but we're just heading over there now to watch the game. Brooke's meeting us too. I really, really like my outfit, you guys. And if you're in post-grad and you don't dress up for your college game day, what you doing? Oh, someone's calling me. Here's my outfit. Hello. Hey. All right, boys, come on, let's go. Let's go drink. I know, we're going to watch the Georgia game. But babe, how would we watch the extra point? Oh, but babe, I need to see this drive. All right, just let me know, because I gotta tell Brooke. Game day, um, it's pretty warm outside. Top is from Princess Polly. Shorts are Evie Denim from Revolve. Boots are Rebecca Minkoff from many years ago, so sadly, I don't have a link, and I'm really sorry. Bag is from By Far. Sunglasses are from Urban Outfitters. Still haven't set up my phone because Brooke told her, told me it took her three hours. So, I guess that's the tomorrow activity. Dogs, baby, cheers. Sangria and Tito soda. <laughs> Brooke was aggressive. She sat down, she's like, I need a vodka soda. <laughs> There's a bottle line in this year. Wait, point. <laughs> Did y'all tell you the story yesterday? Are we gonna drop them? Don't we have to? I think we just. I was just gonna like I pour mine. Say, I was gonna chase this. Oh. I mean, you can. So we asked for O bombs, this is what we got. Yeah, I poured it. Uh, uh, wait, drop it. Drop it. <laughs> okay, alright, here we go. I don't know if I wanna drop it. I guess we're doing it. Alright, three, two, one. Oh god. I finished before Brooke. It's not even alcohol-y, it's like, it's just like a lot of like, like It's so good, it's so good. Ginger Shots trained me. Yay! It's a lot later now, and we're about to go to a comedy club. We're at a rally. Woo, we're drinking coffee. Waiting on Mary, Stephen, and Morgan to meet up with us. You excited for the comedy club? Where are they at? Where are they at, though? They're almost here. I'm excited to laugh. Oh, God. I know, I miss you. The box is like sleeker than I remember. Oh, that was satisfying. I don't remember the sides being shiny like that. This is gorgeous. I feel like I should put the case on sooner than later. Oh my gosh, look at that. All right, I'm gonna set this up. I'll show you guys after. I'm really liking this case on it. 
So I just set up my new iPhone. It's finally done. It actually only took me like an hour, so I'm happy about that. Um, it's so fast. Like when you go, go on Instagram, everything just swipes so fast. The camera is absolutely unreal. That's like one of the reasons I got it. Video, they're cinematic. So when I'm filming vlogs, I'm definitely gonna use this because it looks like I'm using a camera. So that's pretty awesome. And obviously the camera is just such good quality. I am so excited. The comedy club was so funny, you guys, last night. New York Comedy Club, we went to the one in Midtown. Highly suggest, like, professional comedians. So funny. We got snacks and drinks while we were there. I was, like, just done with drinking for the day, so I literally ordered a spray, but um, it was a blast. I, we literally, Ryan, Ryan got picked on pretty much the whole entire time, which I knew. He was wearing, like, a big Georgia shirt, and he was like, oh, how much you lift, bro? It was so funny. I can't even begin to tell you guys how funny it was. So if you're in New York, you definitely should go to New York Comedy Club. I think we're literally going to go once a month because it's it's fun and laughter is so good for the soul. So that was great. Um, I've just been having a lazy morning. I had a bagel. I haven't had coffee yet. I'm going to hop in the shower and we're going to head to the Upper East Side today. I'm meeting up with Morgan and Mary Steven to do... Just like have a little Upper East Side afternoon, um, like check out the stores, they're all like super expensive, so I'd probably not actually shop, but just enjoy, it's a beautiful Sunday. I just love spending Sundays and not drinking, it's great. <laughs> and then tonight I have dinner with Brooke and Peyton, who's in town from LA, so I'm so excited. I've met her like once before briefly in at Coachella, but it was very brief, so I'm excited to like talk to her, cause she's in town. And then, yeah, we're gonna pack tonight because tomorrow we go to Aspen, Colorado. Let's get started with the day, shall we? took me 30 minutes to pick out an outfit that I literally wear every day. I do now I'm late, because I was trying to be all cute Upper East Side, and I just don't have a lot of cute summery things, and I don't really want to buy summery things right now, because it's about to get cold. So here we are, the traditional black bodysuit, blue jeans, Converse look. I, I'm so creative right now. I just wanted to be comfortable but cute, and she said she was wearing jean shorts. Ugh, the struggle. Um, I really wish I had a cute dress to wear, but I just did not. Bodysuit Zara, necklace, um, Orium Collective, sunglasses, Cheeky Peach in Athens, Balenciaga bag, jeans are from a gold day, platform converse. Let's go meet up with Morgan, and I think Mary Steven's joining too. Walking on Madison Avenue, it's so pretty up here. We just stopped in a little, oh, Lululemon. We just stopped in a little market, lots to see. It's the most perfect, beautiful day. Um, so updates to come of oh my god, Madewell? This is a nice little road. Listening to Taylor Swift, doing the dishes, just cleaning up. I see Ryan's been here. He uses my washer and dryer. Um, and I am just starting to pack for Aspen because we leave tomorrow morning. Planning outfits right now, and it's I'm getting so excited to layer for fall. I'm just trying some things out since it's not super cool, but I just, I don't know. This could be a fun vibe with some boots. Um, I'm just wearing this like white turtleneck from Free People. Shirt over top is from Express. It's got some shoulder pads, and then these jeans are from Princess Polly. I already know a lot of you guys are gonna comment saying you should cut your hair like that. I'm just not going to. I'm just too scared, but maybe one day. Or I just took off the gray sweater and threw this jacket over. Also fun. I have so many outfits planned and then I just looked at the itinerary. And basically in the daytime we're doing more active things. So I need to pack some active wear and then I need two dinner outfits and a cocktail hour outfit. Super quick change for dinner. I'm wearing this black top um, from Mesh Key. Princess Polly pants, the little black trousers, my new favorite blazer from Urban Outfitters, Bottega bag, and white sneaks. I put my hair up because I was just so tired of it. I need to wash it later. We're going to this restaurant called Dudley's. I'm so excited to see Peyton and catch up with Brooke. It'll be a good time. Let's go. Ran into Ryan. Ryan just got a haircut. Yeah, first time in New York. Looks good. He's going to the gym. I'm going to dinner. <laughs> oh, you're wearing your new shorts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they fit nice. They do fit well. Podcast sponsor, we love that. Hey, cutie. 
We're headed to Dudley's, meeting with Peyton. Look at Brooks. Brooke is a gal on the go today. She's like moving, we're in between trips. And you still look cute. <laughs> Eating at Dudley's. Yeah, wait, this is such a cute, what street is this? All right, I'm here with Peyton. Hi. We're just catching up. We all got espresso martinis because that just had to happen. Food looks amazing. Another little outfit option. Back from dinner, it was so much fun. Went and got my suitcase for my storage unit. I'm gonna attempt to carry on because I just don't want my bag to get lost. Ryan's here. <laughs> Watching TV and doing his laundry. And yeah, gotta wake up really early tomorrow, so. Drinking some sleepy time tea. Just showered, letting my hair dry. I'm so sleepy. I'm really proud of myself. I think I got just about everything in here. This suitcase doesn't have zippers. It's all like a clamp, which is cool, but also makes it a little harder to close sometimes. I'm just making sure that's what I'm wearing tomorrow with my sneakers. I'm just, I feel like I'm underprepared, but Fine. So excited to go to Aspen. I'm so excited to be one with the mountains. Ryan's headed on a business trip to Michigan tomorrow for a whole week. So it's kind of perfect timing. We're both headed out tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed this little weekend vlog. I hope I vlogged enough. I feel like I didn't vlog much yesterday, but um, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you guys are new here. Um, I'll be vlogging obviously in Aspen. So get excited for that. And I'll see you guys next time for our next video. Bye.